Roland Kublawi is an American citizen of Lebanese heritage. He received a master's degree from George Mason University in Fairfax, Virginia. Currently, Kublawi works as financial consultant for an investment group between Europe and the Middle East. Whether Kublawi is writing aphorism or composing music, he believes that he's an expressionist merely transmitting informational energy that he receives from the non-physical world. Never claimed to be a writer or a musician, but a mere vehicle of expression. Kublawi lives by the motto that life without the pursuit of passion is a waste of living. His music artist's name is Ronnie Bassem. Today he's here, connected with us, to present his new published book, entitled Scattered Chatter. Hi, Ronnie, it's so nice to have you here. Hello, how are you? Tell us something about your new book, please. What is Scattered Chatter about? It's a series of thoughts uh, in the form of aphorisms, uh, more like spiritual philosophy. And it's scattered because there's no, uh, just random thoughts that come to me occasionally. And I've been compiling these uh, thoughts over the years. And I felt the need to put it all together in a small book. And why do you use the form of the aphorism to express yourself? How could a reader benefit from this book? I'm very influenced by uh, Gibran, Khalil Gibran. Who, who has a style of writing similar thoughts in the form of aphorisms. I think the reader will benefit. It will sort of open up the mind, but make the reader think about uh, more important things in life as opposed to day-to-day -day trivial, trivial stuff. What or where do you get the inspiration to write your aphorisms? from your life, the environment around you, or maybe both of them? Most likely all the above, um, from various experiences in life, whether it's a good experience or a bad experience. I, I always seek what's positive, what, what could be a positive outcome of any form of emotion or experience. And what's your best moment in your daily life for writing and what does writing mean to you it's just thoughts that come to me i come from my mind and uh it's probably another aspect of me uh i would assume we have to be a non-physical aspect i think we all have an aspects of ourselves that's non-physical so it's sort of uh, being connected with with the higher self do you remember any of your aphorisms you would like to quote right now yeah, I remember a lot. I'm trying to remember some of my favorites. I would like to quote something from Gibran, actually, that that opened my mind to write aphorisms. It was uh, it was just by chance. I was in the United States. Uh, I was drawn to a library, to a particular shelf, to a particular book. I did not know who the author was. I pulled the book, it happened to be for Gibran, Khalil Gibran, and I just opened the middle of the book and I read, how can my heart be unsealed unless it is broken? That, that reading in itself has changed a lot in my life and probably inspired me to do the same. And, but to whom would you suggest your book? Is there a particular target reader or is it a book for anyone? Uh, I think it's for anyone who's, who's looking for meaning in life. Yeah, for, for anybody who wants to grow, uh, anyone who, who's not content by just uh, for the status quo, someone aspiring to become more of who they are, someone who doesn't hold on to the past, someone who has no regrets of the past, no fear of the future, someone who lives in the moment, who's constantly thinking and wish to grow. What would you like to tell your readers now that you have the chance to with this interview? I think uh, in the introduction, I speak to the reader directly uh, with a message that uh, we're all in a healing process or 
as if life is healing itself through all of us, because I believe we're all connected in, in unseen ways. And uh, the message is that connection is a connection of oneness among humanity. And that's my message is in the introduction, actually, and the uh, dedication section. Thank you, Ronnie. Thank you for the opportunity of this interview. And we want to wish you very good luck with your book. Thank you for the opportunity. Scattered Chatter is a stream of aphorisms, thought and expressions by the author Ronald Kublawi, who enters the depths of his life and the lives of each of us. The passing of the years makes us aware of the change in what is past and what is future, family, life, eternity. The empirical introspection of our thoughts and our experience is what makes us free from ourselves. Scattered Chatter by Ronald Kublawi is now available in bookstores and digital platforms, a publication by Eurobox.